What's up, YouTube? This is Arceus462, and bringing you some new card information. Now, in this new Numbers Hunters pack, there is going to be Norito, the Moral Leader. I have been waiting for this card to become real for some time, and I, my dream is finally here. And so here it is. It is a light spellcaster. Now this is a spellcaster and a light monster. Rank 6, 2700 attack, 2000 defense, pretty beefy. Exactly the same stat as Bowser. It is a generic rank 6, which is awesome. And whenever a opponent's spell trap card is activated, you can detach a material from this card to negate the activation if you do destroy that card. So, what this means is basically it's it's a Shein for Heretics, Constellers, and some other decks. I don't know if they run level sixes, maybe evil. I don't know. But that deck is so outdated now, it, it probably won't do a good against the meta right now until the elemental dragons get hit either September or or March, but they'll probably get hit September and I'll probably talk about that later. And and you'll see my point of view. So why this card is good in my opinion is not only the fact it's generic and has pretty darn good stats, well, plus its effect, but the fact that it's also a spellcaster and a light monster. What this means is that you can make this even in prophecies. Prophecies you could make this. Because you'd go, okay, uh, bring back your destroyer, and then you either summon Reaper, or you activate Spellbook of Life, banish the Magician, bring back one of your level 4s, exceed into Norito, the Moral Leader. Not only that is she like a practically a double Shien in itself, but also the fact that you can also play Honest on it, you can play Power, Wisdom, Fate, all that and like lose little to no ground and the fact that it's got the same stats as Bouncer. It's, it's basically Bouncer's sister, if you will. Or brother, or hermaphrodite, I don't know. But I've been waiting for this card forever and when it comes out, um, hopefully it'll keep this effect but they're probably going to change it to once per turn, knowing them. But, um... And so, because it's got a pretty good effect, but the thing is, it can only negate twice, so... And, no, by the wording of this card, it's similar to, uh, Inishi. It's a, it's a speed spell 2 effect, so it can't negate Solemn or counter trap cards it can't negate those so good luck against that but anyways um tell me what you guys think of this card and what it's a new effect would be because i know freezer drawn has a similar circumstance and he got nerfed the hell out of there but that was because his effect was too op because the anime effect of bring back materials, okay, I'm just gonna blow up your shit again. GG. <laughs> but I think this is pretty balanced for a card, it, especially for an exceed, because it forces you to go the distance of making a rank six. And not only that, but it also rewards you for doing so. Mainly because I'm a heretic player, and rank sixes are my favorite. Got so many fucking style points. But, uh... Yeah. Tell me what you guys think. Rate, comment, subscribe. And, if you have not checked it out yet, check out Asian Eyes White Dragon. Awesome guy. He's really fun to know and to get along with. And he uploaded a new video recently starring 
me as Flame Lord D19. So, yeah, why don't you go ahead and check that out? All right, this is RC 462 signing off.